Hey guys, welcome to Tropical Flower Gardening. I'm Dr. Manisha. Today's video is on Spanish cherry tree, which is locally known as Bakur tree. The botanical name of this tree is Mimosops elengi. It is an evergreen, medium to large size tree native to the Indian subcontinent. This tropical tree is grown as an ornamental tree, particularly for its fragrant flowers and also to provide shade along the roads and in gardens. You can grow it from seeds, but for early flowering, it is better to buy a sapling from a good nursery. You can grow it in the ground as well as in containers. If you wish to grow it in containers, please use a big size container of at least 18 inches in diameter. It is better to grow it in big size drum because the drum can then provide a depth, adequate depth for good growth of roots. Grow this tree in a sunny spot of your garden, making sure it gets at least 4 to 5 hours of direct sunlight. This tree does well in any type of soil as long as it is well draining. Water this tree regularly and give organic fertilizers like cow dung manure, wormy compost, neem cake powder regularly to encourage a healthy growth. Flowering usually starts from 2nd to 3rd year after plantation. Initially you will find there are few flowers on the tree but as this tree grows and matures you will see more flowers on the tree. This tree does not flower throughout the year but the flowering season is in the summer months. Buds start appearing by March end or so and the flowering reaches its peak from the months of April to June when you will see lots of flowers on this tree. The flowering continues up to July and thereafter it gradually slows down and stops by August end or so. Flowers appear in small bunches and attract butterflies, birds and bees. In this clip you can see a bee is sitting on the, uh, on the flower of this bakul tree. The individual flower is small about 1 cm in diameter or so. It is a cream color flower which is star shaped and it has a crown arising from its center. The flowers become very fragrant in the evening and fill the night air with its sweet aroma. The flowers fall off on the ground next morning. The flowers are considered sacred and offered in temples and are also used to make garlands. The flowers retain their fragrance even after drying and are used to make, make necklaces and also used as stuffings and pillows and for keeping in cupboards due to their fragrance. The fruit of this tree is called Spanish cherry. The fruits usually appear in June. It is an oval shaped fruit which is initially green in color and it turns orange red on ripening. The fruit is edible and it, it is eaten fresh, preserved or pickled. The fruit contains 1 to 2 seeds which can be used for propagation of new plants. The seeds are also used for making oil. The leaves of this plant are glossy, dark green, oval shaped and, the, and they have wavy margins. Propagation of this tree is from seeds, from stem cutting and from air layering. Almost all the parts of this tree are beneficial and useful and this tree is known for its medicinal qualities. The bark of the tree is used for treatment of diarrhea. The bark and the flowers are used to treat toothache, gum inflammation, fever and some skin ailments. The leaves are used for treatment of headache, toothache and sore eyes. Fruits are used to treat sprue. Seeds are powdered to treat constipation. The wood of this tree is very strong and durable and used for construction and for making boats as well as for ship building and for making railway sleepers and it is also used as uh, for making furniture. The bakul tree is mentioned in ancient Indian scriptures and is also mentioned in various Ayurvedic books as a medicinal plant. It is considered as an auspicious tree in India and you will find it in almost every Indian garden. So guys with that we come to the end of this video. I hope you found this video useful and informative. Please post your comments, like and share this video and I will see you in my next video. Until then take care and happy gardening.